Well, I finally got my 15,000 renown for Ella. Time to switch mains. This would be fun. Welcome back to Weapon Guides. Today, we're looking at the God of SMGs, the Scorpion Evil 3. And you're wrong if you say otherwise. I like you. Scorpion Evil 3 is a Czech Republican SMG starting service in 2009, not to be confused with the VC-61 Scorpion machine pistol. It has a jacked fire rate of 1150 RPM. I'm sorry, was I too fast? With a rate of fire like this, this is essentially, in the words of the Russian Badger, What if we took an A-10 Warthog and made it shoulder fired with no recoil so you can be all like... The Scorpion Evil 3 was only available through a daily reward in November 2018, and more than likely will come back in a future event, if not already permanently in a permanent event. As it is with all three star weapons, it will cost you 21 dummy cores for all four dummy lengths. This is about to get a bit deja vu if you've seen CZ805 and Galil's weapon guides. <sighs> Here we go. Damage doesn't really matter for SMGs, but I was surprised to see that Scorpion Evil 3 has the weakest damage of all SMGs at 23 which is just about as insulting as Galil's 2-star rarity. What's worse is that I can spot a good handful of SMGs that are definitely weaker. I'm officially pissed! Evasion isn't poor, but it could certainly fare a bit better. Sharing the 68 evasion with Mac 11 PP-1901, MP5A5, and SAW. Given its decent evasion, its higher health of 970 does make up for the lower evasion. Accuracy doesn't matter as much since damage is not the priority of an SMG, but it is dead smack of the middle at 13 with a low high range being 11 to 15. Ella's Scorpion has some fairly high recoil after the nurse, which does make it a fair accuracy amount. Fire rate is respectively at 93 given that Vector and PPSH-41 are up here as well, but hilariously Uji should not be here. Her RPM is only 600, which is nearly half the amount of Scorpion Evil 3, not to mention slower than Galil. So why is she the fastest firing SMG? It makes literally no sense. Scorpion's skill is practically Ella's impact grenades before they were removed from her. Because of her damage being the weakest, it won't do much more than even 2-star SMGs with the same skill. At this point, it's pretty much just the devs rubbing salt on the already open wound. They already did that with Galil and CZ805, so why not? Ella's thickness isn't just for show, it gives a very considerable accuracy buff to an assault rifle directly behind her. Accuracy isn't the first thing considered when it comes to buffs, but it does help, especially in night ops. Huh, so that's where Ella's accuracy went after the recoil and nerf. That made so much more sense now. As much as I wish for Scorpion to have a neural upgrade, it more than likely won't due to the reason that Scorpion isn't a normally available weapon through the story missions or production. I do have some ideas for a rework which I might consider making into a series. Overall, the Scorpion Evil 3 is an SMG that's been driven into the ground harder than an oil drill. Actually, I'm starting to see a bit of a pattern here. Galil, CZ805, Scorpion Evil 3, Aerith 160, AM9. Although at this point, it's not at all surprising. I swear, World at War had better weapon balance and all anyone ever used there was an MP40 and stopping power. Before I give myself a seizure, I'm just gonna end off here. Scorpion does pearl away, at least for me, but there's nothing really special about it. Simply yet another victim of the Mega Nerf Hammer. Well, that's it for this segment of Weapon Guides. Tune in next time when I dive back into its teaching where another T-Doll proposes to me that I really don't want to be a part of. Ah! 
花を踏みながら前に進まないといけない場所です。Make it at least challenging.